Summer, a time for play, a time for pleasure, a time to be a child again, a time to not be so strict and rigid, a time for your passion projects, a time to refresh your mind and soul, a time for you to be you. When you were a kid, was summer typically a happy time for you? School is out. You get to have sleepovers with your friends. You spend a random Tuesday at the pool eating pizza, followed by more summer activities. You were excited to live. You weren't worried about what you had to do tomorrow or the next day. You just lived. So what happened? What happened to that inner freedom? To the innocence of life? Did it dissipate by the rules and regulations that you've attached to your everyday life? Did it vanish because you've let your worries and fears stop you from actually living? You're the only person who can answer that. But let me tell you a secret. Nothing actually changed. The only difference between who you were when you were a kid and who you are now is you've added more years to your life and you've experienced more within those years. You might say those experiences have changed you, and I'm sure it has for the better. You're wiser than when you were a kid, and you've gotten to experience so much life, which is pretty cool. It's easy to think that us as a child was someone else. Someone out of reach. Someone light years away. But that's so far from the truth. You're still a child on your own journey, navigating the waves of life, testing the waters. One way that helps connect me to my inner child is to live in tune with the seasons, to be one with mother nature, And before you even think about it, I get it. I get that you have bills to pay and emotions to work through and a family to keep up with and a job that takes up a lot of your time. But if you keep on this track of neglecting your inner needs, your inner passions, your desires and your dreams, you might find yourself running through life and when it's far too late, You'll ask yourself, where did my life go? As you get comfortable with living in tune with nature, you will naturally want to keep doing it. You'll long to feel like a kid again the more you practice inner child work. Staying in harmony with the season brings healing It brings a bliss about life, a type of softness in the air, an addicting yet healthy kind of love. So play in the water, eat a peach by a creek, take your dog swimming, let loose, kiss in the rain, decorate your home with colorful flowers that make you feel happy, redecorate your space, Watch a sunset, but lastly, stay present. Yesterday is long gone. Tomorrow isn't promised. This moment is all you have. So how will you make of it?